Hi, my name is Andrew Sears, and I'm the president of City Vision University, and I'm going to give a brief overview of our trauma and crisis counseling course. Um, just so you understand, the design of this course is we're really trying to do three things. One is we're taking a core um, textbook on trauma and crisis counseling. These are aligned with KCREP um, counseling standards that are needed for an LPC. Um, even though we aren't KCREP accredited, we still align with those standards. Um, and then what we do is we want to provide Christian integration. So we have Christian trauma counseling. We're using a book called Restoring the Shattered Self. Um, and that it not only brings in a Christian perspective, but it has a particular focus on co um, complex trauma, which a lot of our students and our partner organizations, um, the clients they work with, um, generally um, more commonly have complex trauma. And then the uh, third is um, trauma-informed addiction counseling um, using material from SAMHSA, um, the Trauma-Informed Care and Behavioral Health Services. So the course outcomes, by the end of this course, you should be able to, we want you to understand the history of the discipline of trauma and crisis counseling, um, to analyze different crisis intervention strategies and their role in uh, de-escalation and trauma-informed care, um, to reflect on your own history of trauma and how that might influence your ability to counsel and support clients in trauma. Um, the next thing you'll be able to do is to compare and contrast the diagnostic criteria of three different types of trauma diagnoses, ASD, PTSD, and complex PTSD. And then the next um, is to develop treatment plans and techniques based on those different diagnoses and other factors, creating a trauma-informed care plan for your organization, evaluating clinical approaches to crisis and intervention and trauma in light of a biblical perspective, and assess and respond to your own potential for burnout, compassion, fatigue, and vicarious trauma given your current context. So that's the quick summary. You can see the outline of the different topics that we're going to cover um, in this, and just recognize that this will take about 17 hours per week for this course. Um, and the, the design philosophy we have in this course is, you know, you're going to go through and, and take notes and there's going to be a lot of quizzes. That's going to be more the low level learning. But the key thing is it's going to be the application analysis, evaluating, creating. And that's going to be done through the assignment. So hopefully all this is helpful. If you have any questions, please ask your faculty member.